Hello friends. In this problem we have been given that 6 minus x raised to the power x square plus 7x plus 12 and this is equals to 1. Then you have to find what is the value of x that satisfy this equation. How will you solve this problem? Now this problem is something like your base and then you have exponent. That is let us say 6 minus x is a then a raised to the power x square plus 7x plus 12 let us call that as b. So a raised to the power b is equals to 1. Now this situation is possible only for limited number of cases. For example in this case first case if b is equals to 0 and a is not equal to 0 in that case you will have this is equals to 1 that is a raised to the power b is equals to 1. The second situation you can have if a is equals to 1 and b is any real number so b belongs to real number so this is b is a real number in that case also this equation that is a raised to the power b is equals to 1 will be satisfied third situation you can have a is minus 1 and b is a even number so b is basically even in that case also this equation will be satisfied so now we will discuss three cases separately so the first case in this case you have b is equals to 0 but a is not equal to 0 so this means b is the exponent that is x square plus 7x plus 12 and this is equals to 0. Now I can factorize so this is x square plus 4x plus 3x plus 12 is equals to 0 and if I take x common this is x plus 4 and if I take 3 common this is again x plus 4. So we will have x plus 3 into x plus 4 this is equals to 0. So from this case what I can say I can let me write here so x plus 3 into x plus 4 is equals to 0 this means x is equals to minus 3 or minus 4 and you also have to check that a is not equal to 0 so a is 6 minus x 6 minus x is not equal to 0 this means x is not equal to 6 which is the case so for first case I have two possibility x is equals to minus 3 or minus 4 now let us take the second case that is case 2 and in this case you will have this is a is equals to 1 and b is real number b is real number so a is equals to 1 this means 6 minus x is equals to 1 this means I can take x to the right hand side and 1 to the left hand side so 5 is equals to x so in this case x is equals to 5 but b should be real so this means x square b is what b is the exponent that is x square plus 7x plus 12 7x plus 12 so for this case this should be real this is real and you can check for x equals to 5 so if we have x equals to 5 you will find this is 5 square plus 7 times 5 plus 12 which is basically real basically this is true for all x for example you see in this case let us find the discriminant so this is real this means the value of this expression is real this means discriminant of this is greater than 0 so b square minus 4ac is the discriminant let us check b square minus 4ac this is greater than equal to 0 so what is b 7 square minus 4 times 1 times 12 that is 49 minus 48 which is greater than 0 so this means this quantity or this expression is always real 
So in this case, I have a solution and that solution is x is equals to 5. Now third case. So in this case, you have the third case. So let me write here case 3. In this case, you have a is equals to minus 1, but b is even number. So b belongs to even. So what you will have? x a, a is equals to minus 1 and a is the base and base is 6 minus x this is equals to minus 1 this means x is equals to 7 and let us check b b is what x square plus 7x plus 12 so what is the value of this when x is equals to 7 so when x is equals to 7 this becomes 7 square plus 7 times 7 plus 12 so this is 49 plus 49 plus 12 so this is 110 so this is plus 12 so this is 110 so this is basically even so this means x is equals to 7 is also a solution so how many solution we have we have four solution in this case and the first solution is case 1 that is here we have minus 3 minus 4 so x can be minus 3 minus 4 that is coming from first case and the second case x is equals to 5 and the third case x is equals to 7 so for this problem basically four solution of x is possible so or you can say four possible value of x that satisfies this equation I hope this video was helpful for you and please share with your friends, like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching this video and I will see you in the next video. Thank you.